car has driven right into a building near Summerlin. This all happened at the Bank of America off Flamingo and Wallapai. Leaving a large hole in the building and a lot of debris to clean up. Fox 5 Shauna Kalafi is on the scene with details from police and reaction to the damage. Yeah, and crews are out here right now in the process of boarding up this very large hole in the side of this Bank of America. Again, this is Hualapai and Flamingo. And if you look through uh, where they're working, you can actually see quite a bit of debris, a lot of chairs, also a refrigerator and a sink back there. Now, we asked the Bank of America spokesperson if this was an employee break room that the car crashed into, but she said she can't confirm exactly which area of the building this is. Now here's a look at the damage to the front of that car that was towed away after crashing into the bank. Police say it also hit multiple other cars on its way into the building. And this all happened around 12.30 this afternoon at the Bank of America on Flamingo and Hualapai. Police do not expect suspect impairment nor foul play in this crash and no injuries were reported. You know, as a New Yorker, you think, oh, wild things happen. Vegas, wild things happen. Overall, yeah, that's lucky. That's overall what's most important. Um, but that's just because of the show. Anything can happen anywhere you are, anytime. So this Bank of America location is closed at least for today, but still no estimate on when it will reopen. The spokesperson says they will open it as soon as possible. But the drive through ATMs on the side of the building are still operating in the meantime. Again, no impairment nor foul play suspected in this crash and no injuries reported. Reporting live, Shauna Kalafi, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.